Good morning, Pisces. I don't have my glasses on today. I don't know if I left them somewhere, but I hope I can see everything. Well, I know I can't. Bear with me. I don't know where my glasses are at, but anyway, it is cold and I don't know where they're at. Pisces, thank you for all those who like, share, subscribe to my channel. Thank you for all those who donate and get private readings. And I really want to say, <clears throat> Pisces, I hope you woke up feeling blessed, well, and grateful, okay? And I'm running kind of late, so what I want to do is just jump right into this reading. Lord, and this reading, I haven't even pulled out no card, but it sounded to me like it's going to be very interesting, okay? All right, now, here we go. Um, oof. Okay. All right, Pisces. Let's get this reader started. Let me shuffle these cards a little bit. And, and Pisces, thank you for all the prayers that <clears throat> Y'all say dynasty. Please keep praying for her. Send out her prayers, please. She needs prayer. She's in a hospital. And she needs prayer. So I would truly appreciate if y'all can send her prayers, okay? Anyway, so let's see where we at. All right. Right. I cannot believe I'm just don't know where my glasses are at. This is kind of crazy that I don't know where my glasses are at. Where did I leave my glasses? They're somewhere in my house. I just gotta look for them. <clears throat> All right, Pisces. Spirits, garden angels, please tell me what I need to know. Spirits, garden angels, please tell me what I need to know. Please remove my energy from this reading. Spirits, okay. The Page of Cups. This is like young love. Look like somebody jumped out the, uh, the cup. They couldn't hold you and you jump into the ocean. And it's like you like free your damn self. Oof, I got a headache here. Oof. Okay, so the page of um <clears throat> of cups, right? Um, what is it? Uh, new love. That'd be nice. Um, a cycle of growth, right? Um, somebody really into their psychic, like you really getting into your spiritual, like you really start to see things. Um, it can almost mean somebody's very immature, really moody, um, don't have a lot of love, um, to offer you, or somebody here, it's like, you just getting away from this person, this person's like, still got a lot of growing up to do, um, yeah. And Pisces, I'm telling you some real shit, Pisces. This is like you jumped out that damn cup and you fucking jumped in that water and ran for your damn life. Like, this person was trying to hold you in a little ass cup. In a little cup. You you hard ass off of this shit. Look at you. You, you, look, they can't even hold you. They can't even, they, they like, Trying to hold your ass. She's like, fuck this shit. you like, I need to get up out of here. And I don't blame your ass. Swim for your life. Run. Um, the three of pentacles. I feel like you 
jumping out this cup and swimming. It's going to get you to be in a better place, okay? Like, be in a better place. Maybe, um, I see one man, two lady, maybe, um, it's like, um, I'm sorry. Let me see this. It's not, I see one lady and two men. Oh, no, it's too late. It's, now, I ain't got my glasses, so bear with me. I feel like it's, it's, um, Two lady and a man being creative. Like, you getting the hell out of this shit is a good thing because it gives you time to get the hell out of the situation and start moving on. Okay. Um, now, check it out. This could be uh, expansion, being creative, giving birth to something new, or it could be a, ch a birth of a child. But I feel like somebody's stirring a pot. Somebody's doing something. Somebody's making something. They got the ingredients out. All right? Let's 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 find some more. Let's find out some more. You got uh, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer like you. You got Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Okay? Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Tell me more what I need to know. Tell me more about what I need to know. All right? Tell me more about what I need to know. Tell me more about what I need to know. Um, the Eight of Swords. Free yourself from this shit. I feel like with the Eight of Swords came the Empress. I, I don't know if somebody's had a baby. Somebody's given birth to a baby. But somebody need to free themselves from this shit here. Somebody feel tied up into this shit. I also feel like, I don't know what, but I feel like with this three of wands, with this three of wands, I feel like, um, with this three of wands, I feel like it can mean, um, um, Somebody, it can be like uh, fear coming up to block your movement or delay. I feel like you're getting away from somebody that was younger than you. Or you can be, you know, but when I see the Eight of Swords and then the Empress, I feel like... <clears throat> Is trying to um, uncover. It's like something here is being uncovered. <clears throat> the sun in areas. All right, you discovering something. Um, you feel like um, something here is like somebody is trying to block you from moving on like this delay they, you know I feel like you are leaving somebody or you want to move away from this person <clears throat> this person may be younger than you or act immature but I feel like this person somebody look like they reading somebody's reading your text somebody's reading this man's text I feel like, for some reason, the Three of Pentacles is working together with somebody. But I think it's, I think you now don't feel like working with this party anymore. Like you, I feel like you need to get away from this person. I feel like maybe you feel like you were stuck in a situation, but you can free yourself. You don't have, you can free yourself anytime you want <clears throat> from <clears throat> being in this, in a relationship or in a, um, and I don't see this like a job. I really don't. I feel like it's somebody here that you just, 
try to get the fuck away from. Very immature, very childish, like to play games, but wanted you to work with them. But how can you work with somebody that has somebody else? And I feel like whoever they with reads their messages, reads their texts. Right? This person, it's like you're not really obligated to be with nobody. You you can get out of this situation if you want. I don't know why you feel like you you there with somebody that's not even worth it. <clears throat> Whoever this, I may be talking to somebody that got. Somebody, whoever this person is, got blonde hair. Is reading this. This reading this person message. Um. Somebody here is pouring something. This person is just seeing, um, whatever potion or whatever they doing. Somebody look like they reading something here and you got this man with his walls up you got this lady mixing a potion and then you got somebody reading um reading um this letter I don't know if somebody here is doing something to somebody, a man and a woman. I feel like it's a man and a woman here that's doing something to you. But you feel like you're stuck in a situation and it's like you found out something. But Pisces, you are beautiful. I don't know if it's got to do with a baby. Like, you don't want to be in this situation, but you feel like you're tied up into it for some reason. With being tied up in the Empress, it's like Pisces. By you leaving this person or leaving this situation or, or leaving something that you feel like you shouldn't even be in it, you don't even have to be in this. You're too beautiful for this person. You're too good for these for to be in a situation like this. Somebody has a cat. Somebody has a big beautiful bay window. Somebody got a cake. I don't know if somebody's celebrating a birthday or something here, but it's a celebration here because I see a cake. I see um, tea. Pisces. You're too good to be in this situation. Too good. You're too good. I feel like for some reason, somebody here, I feel like you have been in a place in your life where you've been feeling like you've been stuck in this you can't grow with this person. It's like this person, very immature and childish. Okay? And this could be a news of a baby here. But I feel like it's two people stirring up things and you found out about it. But you feel like you stuck there. But the only person that, that, that has you stuck is you. It's like it ain't nobody keeping you stuck there. You're, you're like the empress. Like, I don't know. It's I don't know if 
you had a baby by this person or somebody's hiding a baby or you with a person for all the wrong reasons. You're too pretty to be with this. And you're very successful. It's like you are put together. But for some reason, you don't give yourself enough credit. Mm. Okay. Let's move on. Mm. Somebody here got a lot of growing up to do. You got a five of cups. This person is, I see all the cups sitting up. This person is bored. This person, a lot of books. I don't know if they lawyers, teachers, um, paralegals. But this person is looking at all the cups, and it ain't no cups here that is spilled, not one. I see this cat around. So I'm counting the cups. One, two, three, four, yeah. Now, one of the cups got a spider on it. So, one, two, three, four. But here I see, I'm looking for the fourth, fifth cup, but I don't see the fifth cup. But I see four cups. I see Atlanta. But where's that? I feel like somebody, and I see an arrow, but I see, I feel like somebody is stuck in a, situation I'm doing a lot of thinking here staying up late at night thinking about this a lot to think about this change this is something here that's changing all right but this person it's got it's like that I feel like they stuck somewhere in a web because it's a cup missing here. And I don't see the other cup, the number five. It's a cup missing here. I feel like you missing, like you left this person. Mm. The hang the man. You it's like you. It's like a light hit is hitting you. That's reminding you that you don't have to stay in this situation. It's like you, it's like the three, the, the, the three of pentacles. And I just feel like for some reason somebody really feels stuck in this situation. Now the thing is. I don't feel like you live with this person. I feel like it's a man here that is in their emotion and all they think about how they can get out of this, but it's an awareness. It's something that's saying you can move on. You, you don't have to stay in the situation that you're in. And it keeps saying you can leave, you can leave, you can leave. Hmm. Um, <clears throat> something here, I feel like, um, something here needs to be, let me see something, here's the three, something here needs to be dealt with and move on, like, what are you, 
It's like the more you stay, you stand for all. You can't make nobody do anything. That's number one. Um, I think at one time you had a lot of passion going on here. I just feel like financially and everything, you're going to do good. But maybe you are just doing too much on your own. But is somebody here with all these books? See, like somebody stays up at night just thinking and thinking and thinking and thinking. They may wear glasses. I feel like you, this person knows that you done got away from them. But with this five, with this three of pentacles, they might have wanted you to work with them. Or you may work with them. But I see this man and this woman. Like, I don't know if they trying to play you out. But they mixing something here. It's like, I don't know what the hell's going on, but they, they trying to mix something. But you tied up to this. And you can make a move because you're the empress. Like, you're giving birth to something new that's going to make you happy. But you don't have to be tied with this person and work with this person or do something with a person that you don't want to do something with. And I think somebody had a baby here. And I feel like that's why they feel like they got to stay in this situation. And they got to work with this person. But it feels like you can let go of them. You can leave anytime you want. It's like you think about leaving somebody. You just want to get out of this. But I feel like somebody here. I don't know if it's this baby keeping you there. Or... This beautiful place you live at. Because here it shows a beautiful home. But whoever this is. Feels like they. The five of cup is feeling like this person is. Looking at everything they've been through. But not realizing that all their cups are sitting up. I don't know if this person is a. CEO of a company or something up in here honey. This person is really stuck in their head over a situation. Pisces, are you stuck or are they stuck? Somebody here is really don't know what to do. They hanging upside down, but but they get like this light telling them what to do. The will of fortune, things are gonna be moving on. But don't try to control this. Just go with it. Just like you feeling like you need to let go of somebody, you need to stop letting go of control. You need to just let go of this person. Because you got the empress with the will of fortune. That means something good is going to um, be there for you. But you got to let something here. Stop trying to control a situation. Stop, um, you know, thinking about something. Thinking, or just stop feeling like you can't leave a person. For whatever reason. It's like you, you, you just, somebody is so immature, so immature. That young thing, you know. Um, mm -mm -mm. Somebody feels like someone here got a lot of choices. But all these choices ain't good choices. And I keep seeing this one, and they picking, they picking the the cup with the um. They picking the cup with uh. Let's see what they got here. This fire. I, it's somebody. Did you picking somebody with a fire sign? Somebody that got fire in them. The seven of cups is like you picking this fire, you pointing at this fire. I think that this person is not good for you. You're going into hermit mode. 
And then you go into this nine of wands. Like you really going, somebody going, doing that inner work. I feel like whoever this person is, whatever they in or whoever it is, they, they not, they're not picking the right person to be with. You're going in a hermit mode. And it's a fire sign. As Sagittarius or Leo. Like, somebody here don't look like things is doing good. It, I feel like you need to get out of this situation. The not, the, 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 um, what is that? The hermit, it's like you going on a journey. The nine of fire is still like you going, listen to this, check it out. It's like you going on this journey through the fire, right? Um, it's like you're working hard to get through this, but whatever it is you got passion for, uh, Pisces, you know, one thing I always tell y'all. Nines are wish fulfillment or a final judgment or realization, right? Or some attachment here, right? Um, somebody's going through a journey. The moon in Sagittarius. Okay? And again, the, the nine of... Once it's always telling me what whatever it is that um whatever don't kill you will make you strong. I feel like somebody here is feeling like with that five of cup is like they going through memories, but whatever it is, whoever it is, it is whoever it was, it's not. It's not for you. Like, this person is walking. It's like you got, listen to me, you got the hang the man and you got the, um, the, the high fan. It's, and it's, look, look, check it out. So your main thing is you got the empress, you got the hang the man, you got the will of fortune, and you got the hermit. So it's telling you that you need to move on from a situation here. To move on. That it's not it's not serving you. And that things going to get better no matter what. Look at this. So you got the honey, for this um, hyphen, I mean hermit, you got the three of wands. And then the Ten of Cups. Somebody here, I mean, this person is going through it. You, it's like they can't even concentrate on their work. Somebody may work like in a chemistry room or in a lab. But I see it's, it's something here. I don't know if this person is... With somebody they don't want to be with. But they hope and pray that they can be with you. and Or have this family. But this, this, whoever it is, whether it's you or them, it's like they got you in your head, honey. Or they in their head over you. Because all you got here is cups and walls. And, um... Pentacles. But look, the Eight of Cups, there you go. Walk away. Leave all that shit. Up. But all, every one of these cups are standing up. That's the thing. I don't see no cups spill. Every cup on this, even the Five of Wands, are standing up. It's like the Ten of Cups is having that family, that union and all this, but this person is thinking about it, but they, 
they feel like they stuck. And I feel like somebody here is with somebody that should be with. The will of fortune, it says you, you get the fuck out of here. And you looking back for the last time. And that's exactly how you feel. But Pisces, what I do want to say is you need to make sure that, okay, that you know what is going on here. Like, don't let nobody play, like, play you out like you don't know what's going on. Because you know, but sometimes people, it's like you need not to control this. You need to, whatever it is that, because it's somebody in their emotions like crazy. Like making a decision on what I need to do, but damn it. It's like you need to get the hell out of this shit. And you're gonna do good work no matter what. Your your money's gonna be looking good. But when it comes to this situation, it's like you be questioning yourself. Like you I don't know, but it's up to you, Pisces. Tell me more about this. About this. Ace, a page of cups. Look at this, Pisces. It's somebody here that wants to give you everything. The Ace of Cups. A new beginning. Okay? But this person, to me, is given to these kids. But this person feels like you're getting away from them. You may be dealing with a Pisces like you, or a Cancer, or a Scorpio. Somebody's offering you everything, but it's like you, this person is still, it's like this person is giving their money to kids, or helping somebody that needs help, but it's not helping you. Okay, tell me about this Three of Pentacles. Jesus. That Ace of Wands, you got... The Ace of Cups and the Ace of One. And then you got the Ten of Pentacles. Like somebody wants you to work with them. I don't know if this person is married or they got somebody else. Or it's like, I feel like to me, it's like somebody here or they've been fucking with somebody at their job. I feel like maybe they're giving to somebody more than they give to you. But this Ace of Wands, again, something new here. This person looks like they like to. It's something here that you created. I don't know if it's a job. I don't know if. Aces are where the sun is shining, honey. Things are looking good. But. This ace is lit up at night, all right, by the water. Got you all in your head and your mind over this, all right? This ace is lit up, and it looks like it's a cross. Somebody's very spiritual. Somebody wants to build something with you, want to create something with you. Um, They want to create this money. Like, we can make this money together. It's like... I don't know if it's you and someone else and someone else, but this person, they want you to be understanding, cooperate with this situation. But what is what is the thing which you feel is stuck in this empress? I don't, I don't understand it. Look at this. This person still needs to grow the fuck up. It's like you feeling stuck with this person, and you're beautiful, you elegant, you you popping shit off. Whatever it is that you're doing, you want to do it. Whatever it is that you want to make money, you want to make it. With this person or without. But this person is taking a time coming to you. It's like this person ain't fucking... They offering you a cup, but it's taking them forever to offer you this cup. I feel like this person want to offer you their cup. They want to offer you everything. 
they want to start something with you. They they want it all with you, but it's like this. I guess it's taking them a long time to get to where they're going. But you, in the meantime, you like stuck in the shit. Mm. Well, if you want to be with somebody that, but I'm trying to tell you something. Is somebody here that works with somebody, giving to somebody more than they give to you? You feeling like, you know, you don't know what to do. It's like you got your own mind, but when this person talks to you, it's like they make up your mind for you. That's fucking nuts. Tell me what is this five of cups? And this man, I don't know if he's a lawyer. Maybe he, I don't know. But he works a lot of, around a lot of books here. Pisces, you got the, you got the moon card. Somebody here that, again, you're not seeing everything for what it is. Somebody can't stop thinking about you. But it ain't like you in the days. Because it's like you offering this flower. You offering yourself to this person. <sighs> this person here is like. Don't know what to do with you. The four wands. This person is. You got the hang of man here. For the hang of man here. You got the uh, four wands. I don't know if this person got a child. It, I, I, I swear there's a child involved here. It's a baby involved here. I don't know if you're married to this person. This person is married. Got Got a family. But this this car here, look at me like, I mean, it looks like somebody, a, a judge, a lawyer. Maybe you getting a divorce or maybe you wake. Maybe somebody here is got a child. Giving, you know, not really taking care of their kids. Their kids don't have no damn shoes and he got this money. So if your kids don't have no shoes on, you got this money. Um, they're not they they're not acting right. They got money to give, but they ain't giving it the way they should. Alright. Tell me more about this world of fortune. Somebody want this it's like you like this picture, but it's not real. It's like this perfect picture of what something should look like. It's a it's the perfect picture frame, the the tree house, the baby, and this man playing. Maybe that's what you keep thinking of that you ain't getting or they ain't doing. Okay, cause you like stuck in your head over this shit, and you need to keep moving on. But look, the eight of the eight of cups, like they walking away, and you're crying over this, like. This person decide to move on. Either they leaving somebody or they leaving you. But this person is moving on. Mm. So you're all in your head and you got this picture of how you want something to be. But this person is moving on. Maybe you too controlling. Maybe you want things your way. Hmm. I feel like Pisces, you need to let somebody go, but you don't know how to because it's like you want something real bad and you're trying to be too controlling. All right, tell me more. Tell me more about this nine of wands. Tell me more about this nine of wands. But it seems like somebody's really stuck on something here. Or at least they feel like they stuck on the situation. The fool. Somebody need a, Somebody wants to take a leap of faith. I feel like this person they don't know what the fuck they want. Tell me more about this... Um, Three of Wands. 
I mean, look at this. They, they, they want to take a leap of faith with you. Pisces, you got it going on. And this person likes to come in and out, in and out of your life. Lord Jesus. In and out, in and out of your life. I promise you this. I'll tell you I'm going to do this. But in and out, in and out of your life. I don't know. Tell me what this Eight of Cup is. It's like somebody here that you've been with, that you stuck to. That I don't know if they marry. I don't know if they got a baby by you. You got, they had a baby on you. Whatever it is. It's like you got everything you want for yourself, but for some reason, this person can come and this person, you can be on one page in your head, and that they'll make you think something totally different. It's like this person likes to come in and out and make all these promises, and I wonder if they can keep it. Tell me more. It's like they come in and out, in and out. Tell me more about this Eight of Cups. Oh, Lord. Tell me more about this Eight of Cups. Tell me more about this Eight of Cups. Tell me more about this Eight of Cups. Look at this. Oh, excuse me. Okay, so uh, the lovers. They happy they coming to you. They want to move on. They, they want to come and speak the truth. But I feel like I don't know if you got two energies here, two different men, but somebody feels like the five of pentacles. They got money. I don't know if this person is homeless, needs somewhere to stay. Okay, this person, um, this person has money, somebody look like they getting ready to make a choice to come to you because I don't know if somebody put them out or they want to, somebody's going to be going through some shit with their money. This person here is going to really, really go through something with their money. I feel like this person feel if they choose you or come to you, it's like, um, it's got to do with their money. I feel like this person feels like the reason why they if they decide to come to you, whatever they're going to deal with, it's going to, it's going, it's going to take, it's going to like leave them out in the rain. Somebody feel like they're going to be left out in the cold. Somebody don't have no way to live, or ain't going to have no way to live. This person want to come to you, but they feel like if they choose you, they're going to be out in the rain. They're going to be out in the cold. They, they, they just going to be left out with nothing. They can't stop thinking about this. Like somebody want to come to you, but then if they come to you, um, it's like they're going to lose out on something. And I think it's their money. Or lose where they live. Or be homeless. This person to me don't. I feel like this person to me. Somebody is wishing. Wish come true. Um, Aquarius. I feel like somebody here don't know what the hell they want. Somebody's confused. And when they get confused. They make you confused. Because somebody here is like very childish. Like, they come in and out of your life, in and out, in and out. I don't know if this person got kids or um, you got kids by them and they don't know what they want. And I don't know what it is. But somebody, is, I feel like somebody here is afraid of, to commit. All right? Like, this person um, feels like if they commit to you, it's like they got to deal with a lot of other shit. Now, I don't know if it's with family, um, whoever it is, but it, it's it's too much. It's too damn much. It's like if somebody, I feel like this is for a certain person. This person feel like if they choose you, it's the wrong door they're choosing for some Pisces. I feel like this person feels like they 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 not gonna um, 
live a certain way that they normally live. And I don't know who it is, but I don't know if somebody here is comfortable where they live, but they want to be with you. But they know if they choose you, it's, it's going to take them back to living like they don't want to live. Or they're going to really make the wrong move because it's going to fuck with their money. I don't know if this person is married, they seeing somebody, they work with somebody. I don't know, but this is all about somebody stuck in their feeling and don't know which way to go. But it's a lot of coming in and out, in and out of your life. And somebody wants you to believe what they want you to believe. But I feel like this person feels like you're very controlling too. My thing is, you need to be quiet and silent and do move, move through this quietly. And don't be all in your head over this. All right? This person, one minute want to work with you, one minute this, one minute that. But Pisces, it's a lot to think about. It really is. Like somebody want to have it all with you, but it's like they, they want everything else. And every time you would tell them, it's like they telling you they're working on this, I'm working on that. And you believe everything somebody tells you. Make up your own mind. Don't let nobody um, think for you and make decisions for you. You need to think for yourself. All right, Pisces, if you need a private reading, get it from me or someone else. Bye-bye.